Hey friends, Gary here, community manager at BoxCast. And today I'm going to show you how to make vertical content to share to Instagram Reels and YouTube Shorts very easily and quickly from your phone. So right now inside of my phone, I have a piece of content. Um, it's actually our drummer from our church. He was doing some really cool drums and I really was like interested in what was going on. And so I recorded him using my phone. Obviously, if you're using the BoxCast platform, you can actually download a clip right from your BoxCast dashboard. And to, to see that and how it's done, just go ahead and look at the link down in the description below. Um, but I went ahead and just recorded this. And so I wanna show you on my phone how I can easily take this from what I have and push it to say reels and shorts with YouTube and Instagram, okay? So let me show you how. So right now I have the video here. And um, inside of the video, if you don't duplicate the video because your phone settings are not allowing it, make sure you duplicate it. You don't wanna lose the original piece of content. But I'm gonna, I've already duplicated this, but I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna hit edit. And inside of the edit, I'm gonna go ahead and make sure it's actually nine by 16. Traditional video is 16 by nine, but we're gonna make ours nine by 16. That's the vertical version of video for uh, the, the reels and shorts. So here at this point, I'm gonna go to the clipping and editing area. And then at the top, I'm gonna go here and just change the sizing and format. So from this area, this is in free form, we're gonna change that to 16 by nine. And then we're gonna tap here to go ahead and make that content vertical. So this is the nine by 16. So we've changed the way that the format it is. And then of course we can adjust it right where we want it, put it in center and then hit done. So now that we've got it, now we have a nice piece of vertical content saved on our device. We're gonna go ahead and jump into Instagram and we're gonna push this as a post. So we're gonna jump over here to Instagram and inside of Instagram, we're gonna tap the plus button. And obviously this is the first piece of content I have ready to go. And we're gonna tap that and then we're gonna hit next. And now it's gonna give us a little shared video warning, say okay. And now we've just got our content ready to go. Now, of course, inside of Instagram, we can change the trimming. We can add different trims. Um, we could add all kinds of different like fun styles or text or graphics or anything that we want. But once we've got all of that set up and ready to go, we're gonna hit next. And now it's gonna ask us how we wanna go ahead and post this. We could tag people, we can add some topics, maybe even a location. We can even share it to Facebook directly from Instagram, creating an additional reels on, in, on Facebook. But once we've got everything set up, we hit share, and now we've posted that content directly to Instagram. This is a very quick and fast way to create engagement and buzz, especially if you're doing something fast with like say your pastor, and you just wanna create a quick reel to show that you guys have an Easter service coming up like a week before. And you don't need to have very much equipment, nor do you need to have any kind of extra pieces of video contenting like a camera or microphone, okay? So let's go ahead and switch over to YouTube. I'll show you how to do it on YouTube as well. So here on YouTube, as you can see, I've got our YouTube set up. Almost the same way of doing this is we're gonna tap the plus button and we're gonna say create a short. Now, right off the bat, as you can see, it's gonna bring up the camera for your phone because it wants you to do it live. But if we tap the little square at the bottom left corner, we can see that we've got everything situated with all of our clips that we've got on our phone. YouTube's really good about finding the video content on your phone immediately, so it filters out pictures. It only looks for videos. So we're gonna tap the one we want, which is gonna be this one here of our drummer. And now that's uploaded and ready to go. And again, we can adjust the video. We can make some trims if we want. Once we've got it the way we like it, we'll hit done. And now that content is being pushed to our YouTube account. Again, very quick and easy methods for adding content to your social media directly from your phone. All right, well, I'm glad you guys got to watch this. If you have any comments, questions, or anything else in return, just go ahead and make a direct comment down below. We're more than happy to help you. And as always, happy streaming.